Word stress. Having appropriate word stress in your speech involves not only your ability to stress the correct syllable in a word, but also your ability to pronounce the unstressed syllables by making them softer, shorter in length, and lower in pitch. A popular sound in unstressed syllables is the schwa. For example, each of the following words has a schwa sound. The schwa sound is bolded. Ability. Among. Communication. Listening Activity 1. Identifying the schwa sound in unstressed syllables. Listen to the speaker say the following words. Which letter represents the unstressed schwa sound? Then say the words with the speaker. 1. Harmony. 2. Provide. 3. Electricity. 4. Underground. 5. Alternative. 6. Distinguishable. 7. Astronomer. 8. Mechanize. 9. Association. 10. Isolation. Having appropriate word stress also means that you are familiar with parts of speech word stress patterns. If you know if a word is a noun or verb, for example, you may be able to determine where the word stress falls. You will now formulate some general word stress patterns with compound nouns, two noun compounds, reflexive pronouns, and tenantine numbers. Listening Activity 2 Compound Nouns Listen to the stress in compound nouns, then say the words with the speaker. 1. Seaman. Hire a seaman. 2. Blackbird. Watch the blackbirds. 3. Campsite. Choose a campsite. 4. Blackboard. Erase the blackboard. 5. Hat rack. Move the hat rack. 6. Pitchfork. Use the pitchfork. 7. Bookstore. Return to the bookstore. 8. Airport. Leave the airport. 9. Laptop. Buy a laptop. 10. Textbook. Sell a textbook. Which part of the word is stressed? The first or the second part? Answer. The first part. So the rule is stress the first word more than the second word in a compound noun. Listening Activity 3, Two Noun Compounds. Listen to the stress in two noun compounds. Then say the words with the speaker. 1. Air conditioner. Repair the air conditioner. 2. Traffic jam. Caught in a traffic jam. 3. Auto dealer. Talk to the auto dealer. 4. Car salesperson. Visit the car salesperson. 5. Laptop computer. Buy a laptop computer. 6. Republican Party. Go to a Republican Party. 7. Insurance building. Bring bill to the insurance building. 
8. Glass cleaner. Find the glass cleaner. 9. Baseball game. Play in a baseball game. 10. Piano lessons. Taking piano lessons. Which word is stressed? The first or the second one? Answer, the first one. The rule? Stress the first word more than the second word in a two-part compound noun. Listening activity four, reflexive pronouns. Listen to the stress and reflexive pronouns, then say the words with the speaker. One, myself, went by myself. Two, yourself, give yourself a break. Three, himself, see himself in the mirror. Four, herself, write herself a note. 5. Ourselves. Respect ourselves after taking the exam. 6. Themselves. Treat themselves to movie and dinner. Which part of the pronouns are stressed? The first or the second syllable? Answer. The second syllable. So the rule stress the self part of reflexive pronouns. Listening Activity 5, Teen Numbers. Listen to the stress in teen numbers, then say the words with the speaker. 1. 13. 13 candles. 2. 14. 14 mile run. 3. 15. 15 TOEFL students, 16, 16 chairs in the classroom, 5, 17, 17 ping pong balls, 6, 18, 18 trees in the backyard, 7, 19, 19 bags of flour in the house. Which part of the number is stressed? The first or the second syllable? The answer, the second syllable. Rule, stress the teen part of the number. Listening activity six, numbers of 10. Listen to the stress in numbers of 10, then say the words with the speaker. One, 30. 30 sports cars, 2, 40, 40 reading questions, 3, 50, 50 buildings on campus, 4, 60, 60 pieces of pizza, 5, 70, 70 bushes in the yard, 6, 80, 80 shirts on sale in the store, 7, 90, 90 watches in the mall. Which part of the number is stressed, the first or the second syllable? Answer, the first syllable. Rule, stress the first part of the number. Listening activity 17 and numbers of 10. Listen to the statement to determine which number you hear. Then repeat each statement after the speaker. Number one. The dress cost her eighteen dollars. Two. After taking Highway 15 for 300 miles, she took Interstate 70 for the remainder of her trip. Three, a chilly temperature of 14 degrees, the day only got colder as the Arctic front approached. Four. 
four. Only 50 students attended Professor Salem's lecture. Five. Sixteen televisions were stolen from Circuit City last night. Six. At the age of 30, she won the gold medal in the women's 100 meter freestyle swim. Seven. The car went another 90 miles before its transmission ceased. Pronunciation Practice 8 Sentences In this exercise, you will read some sentences aloud. It is suggested that you read the sentences silently first, paying particular attention to word stress. Remember to make the stress syllable louder, clearer, longer, and higher pitched. Then you will make a digital recording as you read the sentences aloud. Make sure that you speak directly into your microphone so you can get a clear recording of your pronunciation. After you finish, compare your recording to a sample native speaker recording. Pause the video to make your recording now. Now listen to me read the seven sentences. 1. Thirteen blackbirds flew away because thirty jackhammers were disrupting their nap time. 2. I see myself as one of fifty candidates who could become the next postman at the 15th Street mail office. 3. She purchased herself seventy wool sweaters that she will sell at a retail shop on 17th Avenue. 4. Eighty dog sled teams competed among themselves in 18 below zero temperatures on snow-covered terrain in Juneau, Alaska. 5. To celebrate July 4th, we launched 16 Roman candles into the night sky, which gave ourselves a rather lively celebration. 6. Fourteen chemistry students worked themselves so hard that they read their entire textbook in a little less than 40 hours. 7. We found ourselves 19 steel buildings on 90th Avenue, which is where we found some good deals on laptop computers.